The father picked a flower and put it on his hand. The flower instantly came to life. He realized that his daughter was sending him a message. The man saw that things had been exposed. He had no choice but to hold the door of the room shut. When the police arrived, because they didn't have enough evidence, there was no way to arrest the man. When my sister was running, under the pretext of not feeling well, sneaked into the man's house. She searched everywhere for clues. She finally found a diary. When she opened it, there was a neighbor's drawing of a cellar. On the last page was a portrait of her sister and a strand of hair. The man came back suddenly. He sensed someone in the house. The sister grabs her notebook and runs. The pervert was in hot pursuit. Luckily, Lisa rolled down the stairs. She grabbed her notebook and ran. She got away. The men packed their bags. He was ready to leave town. By the time the police arrived, the man was gone. Eventually Susie left. The men were still there. Suddenly a piece of ice broke off and fell. It hit him right on the head. The man slipped and fell off the cliff. He died so easily.